Well, first of all, I did want to, you know, get involved, get some soft skills with mm. like teamwork. Although, and I mostly wanted to apply my technical skills. So I was going on to a computer science mm. course. So I wanted to apply my technical <coughs> skills to something, you know, within the B the, the BIA. Mm. Uh, I want to get a bit of um, leadership or engaging people kind of role. Uh, mm -hmm. That's why I chose the uh, uh, being a co-editor. And okay. that was quite interesting because it involved um, us as creditors getting other people organized and making sure that uh, articles are submitted on time. Mm -hmm. And I want also to develop my writing skills mm -hmm. and my research skills. That's why I uh, had to write articles myself. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. um, I wanted a role of responsibility mm -hmm. because um, I have previously been in this um, other projects where just like I developed my teamwork skills. Mm. So this time I wanted something different, just like make sure I had the leadership skills that I will be needing in the future. Uh, all I thought was that I can uh, boost my CV. Well, I, I basically, um, the team was very diverse, mm. very international. <laughs> um, so I, I kind of, you know, learned better, learned more about uh, dealing with with people from different cultures, not necessarily with with the uh, with the greatest uh, linguistic skills. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so, so so it's it's just important to to learn for for the future for for your future degree or your future workplace to to, uh, to learn how to deal with people who are from from different places from mm -hmm. all walks of life. I learned that not everything goes according to plan <laughs> <laughs> because obviously we're. Um, Lots of students, we uh, do different subjects, so we don't see each other all the time. So we had to come, um, keep in contact um, through Facebook or use the telephone. Mm -hmm. And um, also we had to make sure that um, the deadlines were, um, um, like they, they followed the deadlines. You know? okay. And now in my final year, um, with the design projects we have, we are working in a team. So we kind of have to put that, that about um, those skills I gained into practice. Mm -hmm. So making sure that everyone's finishing their sections in time, making sure that I've got all my sections organized. Overall, the, the magazine was quite helpful. And I found that some skills are transferable in the undergraduate. Mm -hmm. um, because we have got to write a lot of essays, and especially in the final year, that's why I'm now. Uh, you have to do the dissertation. Right. Okay. It's quite a huge chunk of the degree, so yeah. and uh, it requires time management mm -hmm. and writing skills. What I've learned is relate to my uh, more of how I, I I was able to explore myself more my ability. Uh, the first example would be um, I I figure out that I was able to communicate with people in different uh, from different backgrounds uh, mm -hmm. in, especially in English and it's, it was quite ex uh, impressive for me because uh, communication is not just like using uh, uh, you know how to use that language well but mm -hmm. you also need to really to solve a problem within that communication uh. When I think of the magazine at that time, uh, the most memorable moment was uh, when me and or and uh, Philip had to interview Olivier. Ah, yeah, okay. Olivier was um, an alumni of the program, and he's very funny. <laughs> and all the time we were recording kind of interview, mm -hmm. and everything was going wrong most <laughs> of the time. So it, it was quite funny, and and always when I remember this uh, that time. That thing comes up in my mind. It's, right, it's quite okay. interesting. Yeah, you can't get something right at the first time. Mm. So there, there is always many trials involved. Mm. Uh, that would be just uh, when we had the magazines in our hands, just like seeing the finished product. Mm. Uh, that was great. Most memorable experience is, uh, of course, when I see the result. But uh, during the process, it's. Uh, I remember I met a girl and she was really, uh, she was logical and quite uh, strong and uh, she's a quite um, competitive one 
And so you, you know this kind of person is quite sometimes a bit hard to negotiate and to communicate with. Mm -hmm. But after uh, I tried to like listen to what she was really expressing and what she was trying to uh, what 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 he, she wanted to get uh, within this uh, magazine team, and the result is quite beautiful because uh, she uh, gave me a, a a really nice result, which was a map. And it was never, uh, it had never been uh, tried in the previous uh, magazine team, and okay. and and I also earned a quite a good uh, friendship with her. So okay. We are still stay in so contact. I would say they should get involved and uh, interact with their co-writers. I could mm -hmm. say, yeah. There are two things I would say. It's the mo uh, the like most important thing is to be creative and. The especially in the beginning and the second thing is please join the every meeting because like I figured out that I, uh, I, I, I was actually the only one who joined every meeting but like uh, not for everyone it's easy to sometimes volunteer and then sit in the corner and just watch the other the others do stuff mm -hmm. so, so do get involved get the best you can do mm -hmm. um, the, the best you can get from this experience and um, yeah, and have fun. Just like enjoy the time. Um, they will gain lots of uh, experience, mm -hmm. lots of skills, and just enjoy it. Just mm -hmm. mind it out.